welcome to my firing range. You will listen to every word I say. I have not lost a single scumbag on my firing line, and I will not lose one today. Do you ladies understand me? I'll yes, grab some ammo, pick a spot on the range, and we'll get to work. Take one box each, boys. One box each. Aim at the target in front of you. If you hit one, and I mean the bullseye, wait for it to be replaced with a new one. If you move, it will not be very accurate. So keep those boots planted. If you nail down, you will be more accurate. And getting down in the dirt is even better. So try all three positions. Ready on the right. Ready on the left. Stand by, targets. Fire! As you were. Nice shooting, Davy Crockett. Like hitting fish in a barrel, huh? Conlon, Gates, we have two scope rifles available for use today. See how many hits you can get on the long range targets. over to Germany and me and this rock will win that war all by our lonesomes. Talk is cheap, Private, but that's pretty fair shooting. Let's see what you boots can do with the autos. You four head back to the ammo table and Corporal Bates there will issue you each an M1928A1 Thompson submachine gun. Do not let those rifles hit the dirt, maggots. weapons are fully automatic, but that does not mean that you should just spray and pray. Take your time to aim and fire the weapon in short bursts only. Not bad, man, not bad. Get your rifles back up and let's move on to the heavier stuff. You four with the rifles! The MP here will continue to supervise your apparent lack of shooting prowess. Let's go, men. Hold up, Private. I'm gonna need to take those weapons from you.
First things first. Private Conlon, grab that demolition charge from the table. You'll see behind me that we have some beat up jalopies. Today, we're gonna blast the living hell out of them. Private Conlon here is gonna get things started. Private, get your sorry tail down there and plant that charge on one of those cars. That thing is live, so watch yourself. Now get your butt back up here, Private! Good work, Private Conlon. You may just yet make PFC. Let's move over to the grenade station. All right, pick up a couple grenades. Don't worry, ladies, these are training grenades. You think I would trust you with a real grenade? No! Pull the pin and let them fly. See if you can hit some of those barrels out there. Very well, pond scum. Some of you could do better, but it'll do. You don't need those anymore, Private. Now here we have my personal favorite. The M1919A430 caliber machine gun. I want two men. One is to act as a spotter and reloader. The other will fire the weapon. Come on, Tommy. I'll spot for you. This ain't my cup of tea. Okay! Let's head to the border. You may notice we have a fine piece of kraut craftsmanship on the mortar range. Well, you maggots are the first to get a crack at busting that jerry calf into scrap. The first recruit who gets his mortar set up and hits that truck will win my never-ending incredulous surprise! Well done, Sergeant Goblin. Your heavy weapons proficiency has been duly noted. Except maybe for Minoso here, I most seriously doubt any of you will ever be in charge of anything but your own sorry-ass existence. However, there will be times when lives depend on one of you maggots making the right call in the field. I expect each of you to rise to such an occasion. Sullivan, there is a Marine bleeding to death in the open. You cannot reach him without support. Let me hear your call for suppressing fire. Suppressing fire! I know so. You're one aggressive son of a bitch. I bet you'll be charging headlong into hell for the core. Let me hear you tell these pansies to move up with you. Move up! Outstanding. Gaines, 
You, on the other hand, strike me as someone who'll turn tail and piss himself at the sight of an advancing enemy. Am I right? No, Drill Sergeant! Well, ain't that a shame! If the combat situation dictates, you may need to do just that. You are heavily outnumbered, Private, so you better tell your squad mates to fall back. Fall back! Good. I don't care if you're sucking face with Rita Hayworth herself. You hear a Marine call out, you best respond. Private Conlon, you are being fired upon. Your squad is out of position. You need to get your fire team back into formation. So let's hear you rally these boys! Marines, rally up! Good, let's go! All right, men. That's enough for today. Good work out there. But oh my God, Gaines! You've just been shot! Hit the deck! I said hit the deck! Now, there's two things to do if and when you are hit by an enemy in combat. Number one, apply pressure to the wound. Next, if you can, call for a corpsman. If you're lucky, one will be around somewhere nearby. Private Sullivan, I understand you have a medical background. Yes, Sergeant. Well, lucky us. Make your way over there a bit and play doc for us. Conlon! You take Private Gaines over to dock to get him patched up, and then hightail it back over here ASAP! Careful where you squeeze me there, Tommy. Hey, thanks for the ride, Tommy. Well done, Private Conlon. But you've just been shot as well! Hit the deck! Apply pressure to that wound, Private, or we will lose you! Now, call on that corpsman so we can get you patched up and back into action. All right, men, good work today. I do believe that with a little more work, you may have a fighting chance. Let's get scrubbed up for mass. Move out! 